Hi guys, it's me UB Programmer and welcome to the lecture 7 of DBMS series and in this lecture we will talk about entry, entity relationship data model uh, which will be mostly referred as ER diagram. Uh, this is really important step in the uh, development of a database and uh, in this step we will do the conceptual uh, building or the conceptual schema of the database which will then implement it as uh, uh, on our DBMS right so here we will create the ER diagram and let's understand the entity uh, what is uh, being referred as the entity so an entity will be uh, anything which have some characteristics or properties uh, attached to it right so uh, I can say entities with some uh, same character uh, characteristics belong to same entity type so these are some uh, uh, terminologies uh, which you should know about so entity type entity instance and entity set these are the uh, main terminologies and let's talk about that so uh, we have set the entities which belong to a same category we will say uh, we will uh, uh, collect them or combine them into a same entity type and let's see an example so Ubed is an employee and so this employee here will be an entity type and the uh, Ubed which is an employee or you can say the instance of this entity type so this is the entity instance and then all the employees uh, there will be a bad there will be some other employees uh, so many employees can work in an organization so all of those employees will be collectively called entity set right and let's talk about the types of entity type so uh, there can be a strong entity type which can exist on its own uh, like uh, an entity type called employee and then we have the weak entity type which is uh, really dependent on the strong entity type and can't exist on its own so you can say the employee salary so if an employee isn't there uh, working in the any organization he can't get the salary right so salary will be a weak entity type then the topic is attribute and it, it is the property or the characteristic of an entity type so uh, for an example the entity type employee has an attribute salary so salary is the characteristic or the uh, uh, property of of this uh, entity type employee we are talking about right so this was all about the lecture 7 and I will meet you in the next lecture. Thanks for watching.